hair is rose gold look how pretty it is I sprayed it yesterday and I was like oh my gosh I can't wait to show you guys because it's so fun and different look it's literally like in better lighting it is this like bright metallic really pretty color but I sprayed it and it's coming out like really really easy like the tips of my finger are rose gold from doing this but it's so fun and different and it's exciting and I'm starting to live my best life so I'm really really excited but today we're going to be doing an unboxing and a try on at the August Nadine West bag. Nadine West is a monthly fashion subscription bag box whatever you want to call it um and basically in every month you get a couple pieces of clothing and a couple pieces of jewelry basically each bag is seven dollars it comes in pink mailers like this this is honestly the biggest box that I've ever gotten in my August box I have two shirts two bottoms and four pieces of jewelry I have two necklaces and two earrings so everything comes wrapped up in these little like pink bundles and then it says Nadine West um, but basically you just have to send back the clothing you don't have to send back like the tissue paper and everything and I kind of have to say I'm already starting to get really disappointed um, everything is gray Gray was a color that I checked off on my subscription. Like, I don't wear gray. I really, really do not enjoy wearing gray. Um, I also asked for a lot of patterns. I asked for a lot of color and everything. And basically, I think I've just received all exercise clothing. Um, and again, I've seen so many other subscription boxes, and I've seen, like, people, like, talk about their success with Nadine West. But, like, I'm going through and I'm pulling out everything. And, oh, maybe this isn't. Oh, okay. It looks like I got a cardigan. Okay, so before I go into a full complaint session, I'm just going to show you guys what I got. So the first um, bundle I have... Let me get my little slip so I can tell you guys what everything cost. Okay, so this is a tank top. It says Cardi Bite Gray. Actually, no, this is going to be the Hey Darling top. This is $19.99. Now, again, this is the biggest Nadine West bag I've ever gotten. I usually get, like, a top, a bottom, maybe an extra bottom or an extra top, and then, like, two pieces of jewelry. So I've never gotten anything, like, this much. And I've, I didn't pay extra for this, so this is a complete surprise. So basically, it's just a plain gray tank top. It feels stretchy, but it definitely feels like exercise material. The next thing that I'm pulling out is this dark gray cardigan. It says Cardi Bite in Gray and this is supposed to be $22.49. It's a short sleeve cardigan. Like it doesn't really have very much sleeve. Um, it kind of looks like there should be a hood but it's there's not a hood. Okay so I can't wait to see what that looks like when it's tried on. Okay, and the next I have these pink bundles of jewelry. So I read it wrong. I'm getting two pairs of earrings and one necklace in this month's bag. Um, the problem that I had last time with the necklace that they sent me was that it was too small. It didn't fit me. So I'm really hoping that this necklace is going to fit me. However, the chain, like, I'm, this is the same problem again. This one looks like really small. Yeah, it doesn't fit all the way around my neck. And the thing is, is I've never ever had a problem with necklaces not fitting me. Like, I know I have a double chin, but the chain, like the necklace is just too small. It's really pretty. Like, I really had high hopes for this bag and I'm really pretty sad because this is a really pretty necklace. But I really don't know how I could make this chain fit me whatsoever. Um, but basically what this is, it's a gold layered choker. So we have like a plain chain then we have a chain with these gold little dangly thingies and then at the bottom of the chain of the chain there is a triangular um blue marble looking marbleized looking stone i'm still because this is something that i would totally keep they have this valued at 12 i'm sorry they have this valued at 21.99 um, again, this is the second necklace that I've received that doesn't fit me. And again, I have a normal neck. Like, yes, I have a double chin, but that has never ever affected me wearing necklaces. Like I'm at least still able to like wear regular size necklaces. Again, I've never ever had a problem like this. Nadine West is the first company that I've ever had a problem with their necklaces not fitting me. Okay. And then, then in this other little bag, I have a pair of earrings. And I'm really try I'm trying to stay positive because I'm really sad that so far it just seems like everything that I've gotten is exercise clothing and the necklace doesn't fit, but I'm going to still give it hope. Okay, so these are pure, beautifully crafted little starfish earrings. These are so cute. Okay, 
So it says the starfish dangles are worth $12.99. Um, it says lead compliant, not for children, 13 and under, made in China. So we do have a pair of gold starfish earrings. This is one thing that I really don't like too much about Nadine West is the, they don't have any sort of credit account. So I know with other fashion subscription boxes I've seen like D&Co, I've been a part of D&Co, every month for D&Co you pay $20. That $20 if you don't buy anything, if you don't keep anything in your box gets rolled over into a credit account the next month. So basically for D&Co, if you sign up for two months with D&Co, um, by the end of the second month you'll have $40 worth of credits lined up. With Nadine West, that credit, like you have to buy some something that month otherwise you get nothing so like it even confirms this at the bottom of the page it says don't forget your available credit as it won't roll over to total credit is nine dollars and 78 cents so I have to keep something in this box I have to keep something in this bag be able to save or get anything out of my ten dollars otherwise I'm literally just sending out like just getting ten dollars putting out $10 and not getting anything in return is basically what I'm trying to say. So that's another thing that I don't really like about Nadine West. But for those of you who are looking to change things up, if you're looking to experiment a little bit, I would highly like maybe try checking it out. It doesn't really hurt too much. It's $10 the same thing as like Ipsy and Sephora Play and Birchbox. Okay, and then I have one more earring, pair of earrings. I have another pair of earrings. <laughs> yeah, that's the right words. Okay, so I have another pair of earrings to show you guys. Ooh, these are fun. So these are diamond, dangle, and gold. Oh my gosh. I think I love these. Oh my gosh. Okay, so basically, they're a pair of diamond, like not diamond, but like they have a little rhinestone. And then they dangle. That is so fun. I can't wait to show you guys. I might keep these. So here is what they look like. I love how long they are. I really feel like it helps to like... I don't know. I feel really sophisticated in these. I feel really feminine. I feel like I'm like, mm -hmm, I have dangly earrings. You can mess with me. Like that's how I feel in these. I really have, love how long they are. I love how lightweight they're, they're feeling. The only problem is, is I don't know if these have nickel in them or not. Um, I do have a nickel allergy, but it's not severe. It's only if I wear the earrings for a couple days in a row, but these are so cute and fancy. I've never owned anything like these. So I think out of this box, this will be something that I definitely keep. Okay. I have another bundle and the first thing that I'm pulling out of this this other bundle are these shorts so these just look like a pair of like workout shorts um these are it says I don't know it, it says bottom and then it says after work gray so I'm going to assume that's these these are $24.49 oh my gosh that is a crazy amount to pay for a pair of shorts. I mean, they're cute. They're really cute. I can't wait to see what they look like on but oh my gosh still that's that's really, really pricey. And then the last thing I have are these up here. I literally just got these. I swear to God. I literally just got these. Okay, these are a pair of leggings. And they didn't fit me last time. They were too tight in the butt because they were compression leggings. But I got these, like, leggings that I can put my phone in. And that's what these are. These are pocket active. And basically, they have mesh on the side. And they have a little place to put your phone in. And I swear to you, even if I didn't, if even are, if these aren't the same exact pair that I received last time, why am I still getting the same thing? Like I didn't even get a box last month. Like I didn't get a bag for, at all from Nadine West last month because I had like I had to um, cancel my card because my card number got stolen. So basically, the way the timing with billing worked up is, is the, my billing didn't go through, so I didn't get a bag. No problem. But so this is August last month was July so at the last time I got a bag was June and I swear to you I just got these these leggings are $26.99 so I just wanted to share that with you guys um so besides whether the whole half hassle of whether I've ever received these leggings before which I know for a fact I have again even if they aren't the same ones the same type of legging um I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna try everything on I'm gonna kind of tell you guys what I'm thinking of each item as I have it on so let's get into it so I'm actually going to be using this time to tell you guys about the billing problems that I've had with Nadine West and why I've canceled. So you guys can look at the clothing and what I'm wearing and then listen to me talk. So basically the last box that I got with Nadine West, they ended up sending to me too late. So I didn't get the box on time um, for me to send it back out to them on time. So like 
they sent me the box late and because I got the box late, I wasn't able to follow along with their timeline. They ended up charging me the full amount of the bag because they didn't receive it back in time. Again, because they didn't send it to me on time. Um, I was able to get a refund for that. No big deal. However, with the August bag, I told you guys, I only kept the one pair of earrings and, um... Basically, I sent the bag back on time. They got the bag back on time, but they still charged me $140 for the entire bag. They described it as a billing processing error, um, but this is the second time that they have taken like $140 or $150 out of my account and never gave me any notification. They never told me that like they were taking money out of my account. So I felt that they were taking such large amounts out of my account. I was able to get them refunded both times, but they took out such large accounts amounts never gave me notification that they were doing so and I only found out because I checked my banking information so I really felt like Nadine West is like really really sneaky with the way that they're taking money from me and I know that I can't be the only person having this problem so I'm just going to be choosing to no longer support them until they get their act together if they ever do I just found it was really really sneaky um and really like not responsible of them at all so I just wanted to share that with you guys real quick um so I'd love to hear what you guys think in the comment section down below